Yellow spinners of all genders. You frequently ask me to do a reaction video and this request I got recently to watch video made by Thomas Dagua. 160 pen spinning tricks. I've seen it a couple of years ago, even tried to copy it, as it is a hell of successful pen spinning video. But copying didn't work for me, well, I don't really know why. My most viewed video I consider to be one of my worst ones. I hate it. Hello spinners. Alex Sukhov is here and in this video I want to recap all the basic information which I gave you in my previous videos. I swear I want to delete it, but YouTube gurus advise not to do it, to let it live. And still it is not even close to success Thomas Dagua has. I am not successful. Duh. Duh. <laughs> Still, I didn't watch the whole video, I find it a little bit boring, it probably it is much more interesting and entertaining for those who don't know much about pen spinning. So, how exactly am I supposed to react to this one? I know, I'll try to repeat his tricks in real time and find out how many of them I can do, and just for fun. So let's get prepared, let me take all of my mods. Do you know, guys, do you know what I hate most? Setting up a good angle for fan spinning filming. Okay, I think this works all right. Here we go with the video. I wouldn't include the original audio. I'm not sure that it here used licensed music. Still, I don't think that it is. Huh? Okay. Right. I think that his angle is really, really good. I don't understand how people get this angle. Probably they film while standing. I have to ask Thomas Dagua. This is almost a perfect angle. Maybe this is the main reason he gets so many views. Okay, finger slots. Three, four, two, three, one, two. Two years of pen spinning. Thumb run, thumb run reverse, harmonic, I can do that, harmonic variation, <laughs> I didn't practice <laughs> harmonic variations, oh my god, you see how pro I am, see, I'm a professor of pen spinning, I can not do thumb run harmonic, Duh. so minus one point to me, what about cardioid? Thumb index spin, easy. <laughs> reverse. <laughs> no, I've never done reverse thumb index spin, but this looks floppy and like. Do I pronounce sh right? Sh 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 fingerless thumb round. Okay. Did he do fingerless thumb round? Double fingerless thumb round. Yep. <laughs> Got it. Did he start with the simple thumb round or fingerless thumb round? Fingerless thumb round, reverse, double fingerless thumb round, reverse, oh my god, I'm gonna fail at this one. Duh. Minus Duh. two points. Oh, so fingerless thumb, double fingerless thumb round was, and triple was from fingerless thumb round, right? Hmm. I wonder why he decided to go in this order, as triple fingerless thumb around is clearly more difficult than double and triple thumb around. Anyway, minus one point from the previous yeah. trick. Double thumb around reverse. You're, you're gonna leave me without any points, are you? No, I can't. Yeah. I hate reverse thumb rounds. Minus next yeah. point, fingerless thumb index spin. Does it count? I think that it counts. Anyway, I do them in real time, so it is a little bit more difficult. You know, thumb around. Oh, you see? Yeah, I can do that. Fake double, I can do that. Extended thumb around, I can do that. Thumb around, extended reverse, I can do that. Tornado. Fingerless thumb round extended. Continuous fingerless thumb round extended. Oh, really? Duh. But this is a really good idea to learn. 
Yeah, Thumb Around Release. Thumb Around Extended Release. Why does he call it Thumb Around Extended? Extended Thumb Around. Bro, it is so convenient to call it this way. He does something... Something like... I don't know what, what he does, but it is not Thumb Around Release. Thumb Around Extended Release. Something like that. Yep. 1.4 me. Half tap. Okay. Full tap. Okay. Flick. Easy. Flick thumb around reverse. Excuse me, this goes so fast. No. Minus one point. Scissor spin. Palm spin. Palm spin reverse. Pass triple. <laughs> he goes with passes now? Almost this in the middle of the video. Oh, I got it. He decided to combine tricks based first, then pass based first, and so on and so on. All right. That's a good idea. Yeah. Okay, I can do finger pass. All right, and reverse as well. But no one do does the uh, pass from T1. This is this is called Neo Sonic. It's not pass. Is this a properly made power pass at, at all? It doesn't really look like uh, power pass to me. It looks like finger pass. Pass jump. Um. Never did it. I just can't lose points doing finger pass. Come on. Um, one, two, three, two. This is pass jump reverse. Okay, I got point. Drummer? Drummer trick? <laughs> it really does look like finger pass and like his power pass as well. Ah, smooth pass. This looks cool. I'm sorry. I thought this was America. This looks so smooth and nice. But I've never did any smooth pass and Duh. ever heard about this trick. Index around, of course. Middle around, sure. And ring around. Yep. Charge 3, 4, charge 2, 3, he's going to do all charge in all slots. Right. Okay. Okay, yes, yes. Fundamental tricks. How are we really going to watch the how he does charge in different slots? Ah, I hate this trick. I think this is, it is almost worthless, but I know some people love it and use it frequently in their combos. Charge in 2-3, this, this, oh, in 2-4, not bad, double charge 2-3-1-2, two, two. double charge 2-3-1-2, two, two. reverse, deep charge, it's not even a trick, just really simple move. Oh, really? You're going to watch how he does this crap in all slots? <laughs> Do you guys consider it as a legit trick? Okay, we move on to Sonics. Sonic Reverse, Sonic Fall, okay. Sonic Harmonic, never use it in any combos, never seen anyone using them. Sonic Spiral, 
Guys, this looks like a linkage. It doesn't look a, even as a trick. Oh man, am I going to learn new linkages today? Okay, so he does Sonic Rise and then new Sonic. And reverse the same. Oh boy, here we go with Sonic Spiral Harmonic. All right, whatever. Sonic Jump and reverse also, yep. Harmonic. I think that the only harmonic trick worth learning is thumb round harmonic. Okay, inverse Sonic, Sonic Twisted Sonic in different slots. He already showed double charge, it consists of Twisted Sonic and Warped Sonic. Okay, Twisted Sonic Reverse and Fall. I like how he always changes locations of his spinning. It means that he has spent quite a lot of time on filming this video. Corkscrew, Twisted Sonic Jump. Mm. Ah, my fingers are not accustomed to this trick for sure. So, uh, there is no way I can do it right now in real time. So I think that I have to reduce a point, though this doesn't look like a really hard trick. Damn it! Minus one more Duh. point. Inverse Twisted Sonic 3, 4 to 2, 3. Like this, right? No. <laughs> I think I can't do Twisted Sonic. Inverse Twisted Sonic. Okay, new Sonic. Easy busy. Just a while back he called this trick pass T1 to 1, 2. Now it is Twisted Sonic all of a sudden. Demon Sonic. Give me a break, bro. Give me a break. Combination of which tricks is Demon Sonic Reverse? <laughs> you see how professor I am? Like this? Just simple Twisted Sonic, then Sonic. He does just simple Twisted Sonic Reverse, then Sonic Reverse. This doesn't look like a Demon Sonic to me. So here I get a point, but certainly I have to learn this trick. Demon Sonic Reverse seems to be pretty useful. Warped Sonic, of course. Warped Sonic Reverse. Okay, this one seems to be pretty easy. Anyone can tell me actual purpose of this trick? And here we go with some flex. East Sonic, my god, I haven't, haven't learned this trick yet. I don't know what he, it consists of. Pro pass and Twisted Sonic, what's the point of this element anyway? It doesn't look like a Sonic, just, just a link out in Sonic. So, is it like this, right? Yeah. Out in Sonic. Shadow still. One, two, two, three, three, four. Okay, any slots. I, I just show that I can do three, four, two, one, two. Those are the hardest shadows over there. Just to prove that I can do in shadows in any slots and can't lose any points from this trick. Devil's Shadow, Devil's Shadow Bust. Okay, this is this also a link. Uh, Devil's Spin. What the? Uh, what does he mean by Devil's? Okay, is this right? He calls it Devil's Spin for some reason. Okay, again we go with the uh, with Bust. Guys, you can link Bust with any tricks, and that doesn't make it new trick. It's just a linkage. I have very few concerns about showing tricks in different slots, because all of them can be considered different tricks for sure, but connecting Bust with different tricks and calling it a new trick, you can get like million tricks connecting them with each other. There are billions of different combinations. But anyway, can I connect this Devil's Spin with Bust? Right? Back around. Middle back around. Ring back around and probably and pinky back around. Oh my god. 
Aerial back around. I just did it for the first time. I should have an extra point for that. But I wouldn't, because this is a fair game. Duh. Wipers. Alright, here we go. Figure 8, infinity. Just before we connected bust with different tricks and now we do just simple bust. Double bust. Triple bust, just starting with bust, it is not that easy, but it's not that hard. I think I can do triple bust. Twist it, Sony. Oh, here we go. How many tricks are we going to connect with bust? <laughs> triple bust. Okay. I bet he also can do extended thumb round bust. Twist it, Sonic middle bust. Well, yes, this is legit. Demon Sonic bust. <laughs> Bro, you gotta stop. <laughs> Just let's do triple from the first glance, okay. Oh, this does look pretty. From the first time, guys, another extra credit for me. Can I have it for free? Arm roll, arm roll reverse. What was that? He just grabs a pen mod? I can come up with billion of more tricks like that. <laughs> so it is magic reset for some reason. Rock fan trick. Turn in hand rock fan trick. It looks legit, but I have to spend some time on mastering it. Seasick. Can we even consider it as a trick? Okay, I'm about to come up with another awesome pen spinning trick. It is called Writer Trick. I don't show this sign too often, guys, by the way. So... Okay. Swivel, I can do swivel trick, but oh my god, I can't do this trick. It looks like like Rayma or T Rex. I don't no, not T Rex. I don't remember how it calls, but how it's called, but I can't do it for sure. So minus one point. It looks really awesome, by the way. Thumb snap. What the hell? I think I got it. Triangle pass. You can't get a point from me with a trick for which I had even done a tutorial video for a combo, triangle combo tutorial. Oh, I'm gonna suffer, struggle with the reverse, haven't done it. I uh, haven't mastered it at all. I didn't, do, I didn't know he is going to be like that and do... I think that this counts. Yeah, I did one circle that that counts. Okay? I haven't mastered it. Yes, it looks a little bit sloppy, but still it counts. And this was the last trick from his video. I must admit that it is not that bad as I thought. It's not that boring as I thought. It was pretty entertaining. I think that the reason it is so entertaining is the fast pacing. And also the way how he gathered the trick. Passes in one group, thumb rounds in one group and so on. At the same time he showed, for example, double charge before Twisted Sonic. And this makes it a little bit weird. But still, I liked this video. And I enjoyed trying to repeat all these tricks. Losing uh, so many points. There were some interesting and new things even for me, professor of pencil.